Joe, was there anything that you said when you were young that uh, kicked off your becoming a legend? I said uh, two things. I said, it's okay for things to get wet if they dry. And the second thing I said was that drying requires an exchange of energy. And I said, okay, if we change the energy flow of our buildings, they're going to stay wet longer. Therefore, if we insulate, we have to change the moisture dynamic. And that simple explanation was the basis of my career. Um, I didn't come up with it. I just happened to make it simple. The old timers taught me. Well, why me? Well, because I was intrigued and listened. And I, I, I couldn't be an aerospace engineer, and so I ended up in construction. The other, uh, the other thing that, a simple lesson, was that uh, young Joseph, we used to go to places called forests and cut trees down and cut them into boards and build boats out of them and sail them around the world. Try doing that with a sheet of OSB. And uh, I, I, I called engineered wood an insult to wood and engineers. And I said we used to line our buildings with plaster on the inside. And now we line it with paper faced gypsum board. We're building paper buildings. Even the dumbest of the three little pigs didn't build his house out of paper. So let's build a paper line building with an incredible amount of insulation out of materials that are moisture sensitive. The only people that are happy are the fire people because the buildings are too wet to burn. What have we done? Well, we exported that technology to Great Britain, and it's a disaster. I think it was to get even for the Mayflower. And then we exported that technology across the Pacific to Australia and uh, New Zealand. And so Australia and New Zealand are going through a disaster. Great Britain is going through a disaster. And we went through a disaster. We're coming out of it now.